What's up guys, before the video starts, I just wanted to let you guys know that Black Ops 3 Plutonium, also known as the Boy Client, is only on PC, so if you do have a console, unfortunately you cannot play it. But if you do have a PC and love Black Ops 3, I highly recommend following this tutorial because this is truly the best way to play the game. Not only can you unlock everything in the game without grinding, there's almost zero hackers because these admins actually care. And as you guys know, the regular version of Black Ops 3 on Steam is absolutely infested with hackers. If you guys have any issues following this tutorial or maybe something just bugged out for you guys while installing, go ahead and leave a comment for me and I will try and help you guys out. But that's enough talking from me guys and I will see you guys all in the tutorial. Yo, what's good everyone? Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install Black Ops 3 Plutonium, also known as the Boy Client. So for the first step in downloading Black Ops 3 Plutonium, make sure that you guys have purchased Black Ops 3 here on Steam and make sure it's installed in everything as well. And you're going to also want to go into properties here, go to DLC, and make sure that you have this installed, the multiplayer DLC trial pack. And this is because the Boy Client servers feature these DLC maps along with the base maps that are in the game already. All right guys, and then for step number two, you're gonna wanna go ahead and join this Discord server that will give you access to the boy client download. So just go ahead and join those tacticals community server. All right, and then you guys will be presented here with this screen. Go ahead and click Black Ops 3 since that's what we are going to download here today. For this what type of player question here, um, you know, if you're just a multiplayer guy like me, just go ahead and pick casual. But you know, if you are a zombies player, I would maybe go ahead and pick high rounder. If you guys aren't a streamer, you know, go ahead and click non-streamer, but I'm gonna go ahead and click YouTube. And then super easy, it's just right here, the boy client under the resources tab. Go ahead and just download it. It is right here. I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Yeah, and that's right guys, we're kind of doing this at the same time, so I'm learning just at the same rate as you guys here. Alright, and then once it is downloaded, you will go ahead and see a tab here pull up saying Easy Boy Black Ops 3 servers, but as you guys can see, if you go ahead and click play, it says unable to load, import, you know, blah blah blah. So go ahead and just close out of all that. And once you've cleared that all away, go ahead back into Steam, click on the settings tab here, Go to manage and then hit browse local files to pull up your Black Ops 3 files. You will need this file open in order to download the boy client. Then once you have this open, the um, Steam version of Black Ops 3, go ahead and open up a new file explorer page. Go to where you downloaded the boy client and very easily just go ahead and drag it over. All right, and then once you've dragged it over, um, I actually went ahead and created a shortcut here, so just ignore that. What I recommend doing to get to it, um, you know, as easy as possible is just go ahead and pin it. You know, I went ahead and just did that, so now we should be able to just go ahead and play it. So there we go. Now it is opening. All right, and there we go. I'm joining into the boy client. You can see it says boy console. All right, guys, and then for the last part of this tutorial, I'm just going to be teaching you guys how to unlock everything. Go into stats and just make sure all of this stuff is enabled here. And then also at the very bottom, you guys can see it says rank level. You can go to basically level a thousand right away. And what's pretty cool also is that you can go ahead and look at your combat record from your regular Steam account. Everything transfers over like normal. Yeah, you guys can see I don't have the best win loss ratio, but and who cares about that? Also, I don't know if that's facts, man. That's got to be bugged out or something, right? Once you're done creating your classes and, you know, unlocking everything, go ahead into the server browser. And, you know, as you will see here, it takes just a second to pop up here. But you can see the game is, you know, it's somewhat populated. Unfortunately, when the boy client servers were first shut down and everything, um, you know, a lot of the people did end up leaving, including me. I'm going to be going ahead and just joining a server just to show you guys that everything works. And this is why you guys are going to want to download the DLC maps. Um, you know, you're just going to be gatekept from playing this game, you know, if you don't have all the DLC maps. Um, you know, you're only going to be able to play half the time because the DLC maps are picked a lot here in this client um, on most of the servers. But yeah, you guys can see here in this lobby, there are no bots or anything like that. 
It's all legit, real people, you know, just hanging out playing Black Ops 3. But if this is your first time playing Black Ops 3 here on the PC, and you know, you kind of play on average settings like me, this is what I recommend. Go ahead and change to 1.40 vertical and horizontal sense. Make sure your aim assist is on, that's target assist. And then for FOV and brightness and everything, just go ahead into the graphic settings here, go to the field of view. Um, you can also change your max frame rates per second and everything. Then make sure all your graphic settings are set to pretty low. I have this as my um, anti-aliasing setting. I don't know if it's the best one or anything. So just make sure all your settings are low so that you get the best performance when playing Black Ops 3. But if you don't want the cars to look like this and the uh, rocks and everything to look like this, then go ahead and maybe up the settings, you know, if you have a nice PC. But guys, that's going to go ahead and do it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, please go ahead, leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys all in the next video. Peace out.